here we're going to start CMPR and we'll check if there are any updates available. So let me just first resize this a little bit since we're working at such low resolution and we'll click on update CMPR in the help menu and at this point CMPR has con contact compared the files for CMPR on the computer with the ones on the um, software distribution site um, which is subversion.xor.aps.anl.gov um, and it's found that there are updates sitting out there waiting to be loaded. Um, if we had read in any files at this point um, we would lose them so it's warning us and asking us do we want to update and restart. So we'll go ahead and click that and it brings up this the DOS screen and if you look here it says press any key to continue preparing to load and update CMPR. Yes we want to do that so it's going off and it will check and it's uploaded as you can see a new version of the GPLS program and a few other files and um, it's found nothing else to update so those new ones have been um, loaded. This for what it's worth these files are all in the development version of CMPR which is what CMPR dev is saying. Um, so if we were running the standard version we wouldn't necessarily expect to see anything different. Um, now, probably should have shown you this before, um, if we look at fit we'll see that there's some new boxes there that have just been uploaded in this version and that's because we are using the development version of CMPR. That's how easy it is now to get the latest version of CMPR using this um, uh, web updating system.